Hey everyone, how's it going? This is Michael for Spirit Comics. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, well, I do comic book reviews. I do comic book hauls. Occasionally, I'll do a how-to video. I have a little bit of everything. So, if you are up for stuff like that, if you're interested, please do subscribe if you're new here. And, uh, you know, click the like bell so you don't miss any of the new uploads. Also, please give this video a thumbs up and share it around. And don't forget to comment. And this was day 22 of my 25 days of comic book reviews. This will be the short story about Kamadi in uh, DC's Nuclear Winter Special that came out in 2018. Now, as I know nothing about Kamadi, I will read what it says up here. The prophecy was incomplete. Etched into a broken wall of a ruined city. It told of a land where blurry stars wheeled in an endless night and the ice underfoot smoked from great fire burns from far below a land on a land where human a, a land on through the biting storm but was not the only hunter in the tundra. An Ursine war party raid bloodlust driving them to take Kamadi, the last boy on earth. Okay, I didn't understand any of that like you. But, so, I'll just, you know, share this, this story with you. And I did, uh, I did recognize some undertones in this. Maybe it's just me, or maybe I'm right, I don't know. Leave him be. Crack. The cold will take that furless runt soon enough. It treads on King Omron's ground. Such insolence cannot be unpunished. His blazing mane will make a fine braid for my... And then all of a sudden... They fall. Really fast. Because of, the, of an avalanche. The avalanche should have claimed you as well, Kursik. But your king's strength is not mere legend. Come, my true prey hides behind this storm. So over here, we have uh, a son and a mother. Another one, bigger than the last. You're as skilled with the snare as your father was, Tamir. I imagine you could snatch a bird right out of the... And then Kamadi starts to float by. Mom, look. Quietly, son. Our hunters stalk us yet. Is it alive? Not for long. The river's warmth will melt that ice flow soon. It has almost no fur at all. What kind of creature is it? Imagine a world where we humans are the are, are like this. 
a human, I think. But I've never seen one this far north. The stars must find the singing stars. It speaks. An animal that speaks. It's a sign, Tamir. A sign from the lights above. And I had to find that funny. An animal that speaks. He he is the animal. <laughs> I I'm no sign from the gods. I am Kamadi. I am the shaman Dolma, and this is my son Tamir. We are honored to share our warmth, stranger. What did you mean about finding the stars? Madness, foolishness at best, I suspect. A prophecy tells of a land where my people can be free. A land where the stars sing and the rivers boil. Like I said, madness. But it's not madness, Kamari. The stars do sing. My... My mom talks to them. All our holy people do. We can show you up in the mountains. It didn't go so well for me last time. I ran into bears on those mountains. Strange because these people look like bears. You're not the only such. You're not the only soul driven by prophecy, child. King Omran obeys one telling of a cub born in the year of the comet who will eventually dethrone him. Omran had all the cubs born in that year slain, all but Tamir. Mad for his blood, they hunt us still. Now this is what I meant when I said undertones. This right here. When I read th this, I was reminded of the story of the Passover from the book of Exodus. And specifically two r verses. From uh, chapter 12, verses 12 and 13, that read... For I will pass through the land of Egypt this night and will smite all the firstborn in the land of Egypt, both man and beast. And against all the gods of Egypt I will execute judgment. I am the Lord. And the blood shall be to you for a token upon the houses where ye are when I see the blood, I will pass over you, and the plague shall not be upon you to destroy you when I smite the land of Egypt. Now, I have to say, just that uh, one statement that she said there reminded me of, the, of, of those uh, verses from Exodus chapter 12. I was born in the year of the comet too, bro. Though our tribe is sworn to peace, my mate gave his life to buy our escape. His hammer, now to mirrors, is all that remains, except for here, in the holiest of places, where I speak with him still. And this does look kind of familiar. When we quiet our minds, we can see the souls of those we love dancing in the lights. Well, yeah, it's a nice sentiment. It's not something I hear too, but it's a nice sentiment. And she tells him about uh, Omran. 
and it, mostly it's a, and it's just a, it's just a nice short short story for anyone like myself who doesn't understand or doesn't know about Kamadi. And she's uh, Kamadi is listening to what she's saying. Before Omran, it was the way of our people to make pilgrimage here. Now I alone hold to the law. You sound like my grandfather, Kamadi says. He held to a law like yours, though he had only scraps of scripture to guide him. The law told of a time when our ancestors lit a lamp with only enough fuel for one night, yet it burned for eight. A miracle indeed. I saw no magic in it. Each night we lit our sad candles and ate whatever we could sca scavenge from the ruins. No miracle, just a blind, stubborn habit. And she says, but a miracle did happen. A boy lit a lamp just as his ancestors did far into the future they could never imagine past even the death of a world you are the light kamadi your fur bright as any fire because you know his his but they call his skin fur bright enough to guide us through the storm, Doma. Omrin remembers remember our way of peace, Timur. Soon we will walk with your father among the stars. And then Kamani gets up and he protects him. Your ways are not mine, Doma. No matter the law, no matter the foe, Kamadi fights back. Yeah, the little vermin actually bloodied me. Stay back, my soldiers. On our demands, I slay this animal myself. And so they go back and forth. Yeah, what's this? What's this? What's a story like this without some, uh, you know, fighting? And Kamada gets some blood on him, and he does some damage to the other guy. And then the, the young one, Tamir, says, I, I can't just stand, I just can't sit and watch this. Tamir, no! Look at you. You can barely stand, let alone swing an ice hammer forged for one of our kind. Nevertheless, a valiant effort for any for an, for an ant and then all of a sudden crack and they go fall, go falling down the mountain got you Kamadi you're too heavy drop the hammer but but your father my father's blood isn't in some stupid hammer it's in me didn't you hear anything my mom said Besides, I'm better with the snare anyway. And it says down here, Omer's warriors threw their weapons in a heap, as much from shame as relief, at seeing not one, but two cubs born in the year of the comet fulfill the prophecy of ending their mad king's reign. Why is Dolma convinced Kamadi to stay in their company eight full nights, both to heal and honor the memory of his grandfather's holiday, but in the eighth seemingly boundless night, as the others slept, Kamadi took one last look at the churning stars and walked on northern lights. I thought that was rather interesting. I don't know any, like I said, I don't know anything about Kamadi, but, uh, you know, I think that was an interesting story. 
does it compel me to check out, you know, past issues of Kamadi? No. But if I ever see one, you know, that's, uh, you know, for a good price, you know, ch cheap, I might buy one just to, to read it. But I have no desire, you know, no, what's the word, uh, Burp, I have I have no great desire to go find find one. I enjoyed the story as is. And I appreciate it, and the artwork was good. Was good. It was uh, a lot better than some of the other stories, I think. So, what did you guys think of this uh, Kamadi story? This is my review of uh, Kamadi's short story from DC's Nuclear Winter Special that came out in. 2018 day 20, 20 day 22 of my 25 days of comic book reviews i am michael for spirit comics till next time true readers may all your news be good news